Hello and welcome to another Vertical Attitude video. This video is about fitting mirror protectors uh, with reflectors to your motorhome. Uh, these are for long arm, as you can see, not the short arm mirrors. Okay, um, I've gone for these because I like the reflectors on it. Uh, on this side, they've got some screws that fix in rather than just push and stick on with some sort of pads. Um, got this off eBay. Uh, so this obviously do uh, the Peugeot and the, the Fiat model style of motorhomes. So uh, this is the box as it is. It came within two days. As I say, I got it off eBay. So I've not opened it yet, so I'm going to open the box and we'll have a look inside and then we'll proceed with the uh, fitting to the vehicle. Like I said, I've not opened this yet, so this is a yeah, new experience. Don't know what's inside. Hopefully I can open it. It's pretty well sealed up. Ah, along the edge, here we go. Feel it now. A couple of little tabs here. Get them open. So, in the box. There's one, nice and sealed up. Let's pull it out. Yeah. Um, here we go, yep. Yeah. Hopefully there's some fixing for this. Maybe I'm wrong. That's the other one. Lefty and the righty. Here This is the fixing. Uh, looks like some pads, sticky pads maybe, yeah. And uh, some little screws. And these are obviously fixed on the edge of that to secure to your mirror okay I like these ones like I said uh, reflectors this side reflector that side um, there are other brands that are just plain uh, oh look got a drain hole in there as well so water or moisture just get in behind the mirror it's gonna drain out yeah that's good like that so uh, now we've unboxed them, we'll go to the vehicle and attempt an install. Here we are at the vehicle. Uh, it is a bit windy today, so I might have to speak up a bit. Um, so we've got this, we've got the pad. We'll take the backing off this and we'll stick it in there. As per usual with vertical attitude, things are awkward. And hey, we've got the stuff off. So a sticky pad, I'm going to stick this right behind those, these poke out a bit, right in the middle, just that. And basically, this is a snapper fit, real of the mirror. Uh, but first, I'm just going to put a little bit of oil 
right on the edge to uh, ease it on a bit. Hopefully, uh, go on a little bit easier. Um, I have fitted the left hand side, the passenger side, and uh, worked out how to use that. And, uh, like I said, it is a tight fit, a little bit of a struggle, but uh, we'll see with this one. Just using a bit of uh, cycle oil, really. There we go. We'll uh, attempt to fit it now. snapped on. And we need to put this bit Like I said it is windy. I don't know whether you can hear the wind, you probably can. So two screws. got to do is just uh, get them started and then pull it over like that. it is plastic so uh, don't tighten these too much or she'll uh, strip the threads off but yeah it's snapped on here snapped on here you can if you want put a little bit of tape um, around the edges but there's not really much of a gap so that's as secure as it's going to be Job done. Here we are, final finished product. Nice reflectors. A nice tight fit really. Looks good on the vehicle. You can get these in black as well obviously. Or if you want a friend of mine did, he sprayed his, uh, the colour to match his vehicle, which was uh, maroon red. But yeah, like them. Uh, got them off eBay, like I said, um, 50 quid, 50 pound. Well, the same price, but they don't have a reflection.
reflectors here and here. But uh, yeah, I can imagine some sort of impact and protecting your mirror there. Um, it's got that sort of shape on it as uh, your old vehicle. But uh, that'll be not. Pretty pleased. Thank you very much, eBay.